Hello AOS fans, Robin here and I am back again with a Word Wednesday post. Yes, it's Wednesday, you probably have noticed, or if you're not watching this on a Wednesday, it's not Wednesday, but when I made this it also was Wednesday, or was it? I don't know, but it is Wednesday when this goes live, and that's the only reason it's Wednesday, and I should probably be quiet and start talking about the book. Yes, this week I have Bacteria by the brilliantly and amazingly appropriately named Steve Mould, it's a DK book. Steve Mould is a big internet sensation, I'm led to believe, although obviously he's not as big as Pete and Rob of Agents of Sigma, despite him having many, many more views and many, many more uh, subscribers. He talks about science and he talks about the germy, gutsy bits of science. And he's written a book which is called Gross Germ, well, it's called The Bacteria Book, and it's Gross Germs, Vile Viruses, and Funky Fungi. So there he is. Steve Mould is a science presenter and comedian and the author of the number one best selling How to Be a Scientist. You can find him showing his love on science, on stage, TV, and YouTube, and in this book. So here we go. What what do we have in here? It's a great cover. You can't actually see that from the video. Uh, no, you can't see it from the video. It's actually tactile. It has the germy bits. Are oh, you can touch them? Wait before you wash your hands afterwards. And uh, nice frontispiece piece there. Let me show those. There you go. And this book is all about germs and viruses, as you can probably tell. And so we don't have sections in this book. Often DK books have sections, but it just literally is a contents page. But there are things in this book like what is a microbe, all about cells, what are bacteria, your body's defences, uh, the story of antibiotics, what is a virus, fighting a virus, uh, what are fungi, pizza fungi, uh, mega mold, micro chefs, zombie ants, algae, growing green, uh, and then at the end we've got timeline of microbiology, which is quite interesting, and a glossary. And so what is in here? Well, funnily enough, lots of bacteria. Probably millions and millions and millions of bacteria, but you can't see those ones. But there is lots of information about bacteria and it's full of kind of interesting and slightly queasy making pictures. Uh, so there's a, like a mouldy hand on a Petri dish. Uh, and it's a great book. It's a really engaging book. The science of microbes is fascinating and uh, Steve Mould has brought it to life in this book. I'm trying to find you some pictures that will amuse your children. There's one of somebody going to the toilet talking about uh, horrible, um, uh, about, well, about poo really, about spreading germs through your poo and cholera and drinking dirty water. And it has things like about half the weight of your poo is bacteria. There you go. Uh, can of squid glow. So it talks about phosphorescent bacteria and microorganisms there. And basically, this has got everything in it you might ever want to know, and probably quite a lot more for some of you, about bacteria. So there's stuff about uh, fighting viruses here, the vital importance of vaccinations in combating viruses, and uh, you know, how important that is. Uh, deadly tricks, so how viruses multiply by taking over the cells, so how rabies works, so how, that, how they spread, how they, how they make everybody ill, and what their purpose is for that. Uh, and then we move on to some fungi, freak, freaky fungi, a nice fungal infection on our foot. Who doesn't like a book with a nice fungal infection on the foot? And uh, look at that, some mould. Yes, it's good old mould, Steve Mould on mould. There it is. And we've got a picture of Steve Mould standing on this mouldy tomato. Uh, so there's a how, how things go mouldy in it. Yep, so there's stuff in here about these, these mind controlling spores that grow on ants and then get into the ant nest and grow more spores and on and on and on. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty gross and pretty fascinating if you're of that age. Algae, lots of stuff on algae and why rivers go green. Protozoa, so there really is anything that's small. Here we are, some micro animals. Look at that, that's the sort of page that's going to freak out mum and dad. Um, I really do like this book. So that is the Bacteria book by Steve Mould, and it's really great. It's full of uh, great diagrams and really interesting stuff in there, and it will appeal to that disgusting thing that children love, um, which is, I'm guessing, what DK and Steve Mould are banking on. Uh, but it is really informative too. It'll tell you all sorts of really important stuff and really interesting stuff about transmission of uh, diseases and you know, the importance of washing your hands and all that sort of thing. So that's a really, really great book. That's the Bacteria book, um, and uh, that was Word Wednesday. So I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you found it useful. Until next time, uh, when I have another book for you, uh, take care and please make sure you wash your hands. Bye.